the case, uh, it declines a Swiss uh, health company. They have probably like uh, two or three hospitals that are considered uh, on the premium sector uh, on the Swiss market. Uh, uh, our decision to move uh, out of AWS and cloud providers was uh, driven mostly by two things. Uh, the first one was, of course, the bill. The bill was getting high really, really fast. Uh, when you were summoning like a storage, already the resources you were uh, using for to run their models and, and uh, all these things that, that are required for that. Uh, and the second thing that also plays a huge role, uh, that played a huge role for that, was mostly the legislation on the Swiss uh, government. So it's a health company. I mean, we're talking about the AI, everyone nowadays, and all the governments are trying to find the best way to uh, somehow make sure that the data would not be used for some uh, shady purposes. So was cost and security? Uh, if, if we could like put it in one sentence, I would just say like cost saving and security. So uh, when we were on AWS, when the client was on AWS, uh, their bill was probably around 40000 per month uh, and in, time, uh, in terms of resources. But nowadays they're running around 50000 per day, if I'm not mistaken, or roughly uh, that number. So the increase is, is quite big. Uh, of course, because of the increase, uh, we are at the moment, if we go as we are, around 60%. Uh, 60%, 65% uh, improvement on cost. And something that at least was even better than we expected was the support. So as I said, too, like we set up this escalation system uh, for them, and we accounted for around 20 hours uh, on a monthly basis. And nowadays, we are probably like eight hours, five hours. So as we wrap up, what key lessons or advice would you share with other organizations watching this who are questioning their current cloud spend and considering repatriation or a different cloud strategy or basically moving to other platforms, cloud or not? I think uh, the most important thing is to understand if your business has like these sort of spikes of usage. So if that's the case, uh, definitely cloud would be the solution. Uh, but if you have a constant usage and you know what it is, it will be useful to reconsider the numbers. It's, it's pretty easy to keep track of that. And I, I think it more, makes more sense to, to have it in-house. So it, it's always better to, to have either a hybrid option or to explore either what works best for your use case.